Hi everyone, welcome to Hashtag Deck the Year. This is an open collaboration hosted by Penny's Crafty Creations. All that information will be down below. If you just click on the Hashtag Deck the Year, you will find all kinds of people participating both from 2024 and from 2023 when I think Penny started this. So I had on my list to do coffee themed this week. And oh my goodness, I got a little overwhelmed because I have so much stuff. But I kept thinking I want to use stickers, but the stickers are so big. I ended up using the stickers, but because I have all kinds of stamp sets and dies and washi tape I really wanted to use, and I thought the stickers would go with them, but yeah, no, they didn't. So I ended up using this embossing folder I've had at the Tim Holtz Texture Fades. I have no idea when I got it. I know this was one of the first things like in the early stages of my paper crafting, so probably I got it in 2017. Yeah, it's a 2014 uh, item, so I'm sure I got it on sale somewhere, maybe even Tuesday morning or something. So this is a scrap. I had a black card stock scrap that was a rectangle, and I ran it through that embossing folder, and then I just took this Whisper White ink pad and rubbed it over the top of the paper uh, just to highlight the coffee mugs and things. Now a lot of it got buried. I don't use this ink pad very often. The ink is very thick. You have to have a refill if you get one of those, uh, by the way. So anyway, but it does work to highlight, you know, emboss things. I used a little bit of this bright pink um, trim tassel ribbon, bright pink tassel ribbon. It was 25 cents at a Hobby Lobby at some point. Uh, originally 99 cents. I guess that was a clearance item. I used one of these. I have no idea where I got them or if someone gifted them to me. And then this had been an unopened pack of stickers and I just used two of them. A larger one and a, a smaller heart than this that now that looks like it has glitter, but it doesn't, and the other one was just plain pink. But they are dimensional, and I took all the dimension off the hearts. But then I added um, uh, neon flamingo stickles, and I think that's about it. Let me bring it in. Also, just so you can see, this is a playing card. It's out of the deck I'm using to do this collab from my mother's house. She had two decks of cards there used and I'm using them. <clears throat> okay, so this, you can see a little bit of the black background with the um, white on them. And this is like a travel coffee mug. This whole thing was the sticker. And this was a sticker that had been double dimensional too. And I took both the dimension things off and put stickles all over it, put a little stickles here and a little stickles on those hearts. Uh, just glued this down with some Fabri-Tac and put uh, this jemmy on with, I think, Fabri-Tac also. I did go around the edges, I forgot to mention that, with just, I just used um, Memento Tuxedo Black because I had it out. And also, I, I've already done the back two and a half by three and a half inches on just a piece of uh, used white cardstock <laughs> from a boo-boo piece and um, it's going to get glued down on the back but the stickles was still wet and I used I have a, um, a stamp like this and I just stamped made with love by Dev House Crafty Cottage hashtag deck the year 2024 week 15 which really confuses me because the other collab I'm doing it's week 14 on Tuesday but this is week 15 on Thursday and it just I, I, I really have to write it down all the time because I forget and I, you see I thought it was 14 anyway April 11th which is Thursday host is Penny's Crafty Creations but I made this on Wednesday April 10th and I'm pre-recording the video so this will go on the back and cover it up um, and it should it's a tad big and I might have to, no, I think it'll work. No, it's just a sliver big. Well, I'll just probably let it go and re-ink it a little bit around the edges. 
once I get this on because I did ink around the edges of the card too. Anyway, that is my easy project this time. I have a lot going on, um, so I made it easy this time. And I still have all these stickers, plus I have some other ones. Plus I have, like I said, all these stamps and dies and things. For example, this one from Fiskars. I was thinking of using that too for tea or coffee, but I, I wanted to get coffee beans on there somewhere, but I didn't. And also my original plan, the reason I had coffee on my agenda is because if you saw my planner, you know, I used um, scraps <laughs> from this Love You A Latte paper pad. But, and I was trying it, I thought, well, maybe the pink would go, but it's a totally different pink and it just didn't look right. So, and it's, this is more browns and pinks and this is more hot pink and black. So I scrapped it and went this way instead. And I think it came out cute. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Please uh, hit the hashtag. People can post anytime, you know, to either on Thursday or um, I guess even up until the following Thursday. And some people post once a month and do all the weeks, and that's fine too. So anyway, I'm trying to just do it each week this month. Um, so, and even if I do them in the head, I'll still post separate videos on each Thursday. Okay. Take care. Hugs, love, and peace. Thank you so much for watching.